Hey guys, so welcome back to my channel. Um, today's look is pretty much a gold, a glittery gold smoky eye. I use mostly drugstore products to achieve this look. And I kind of just wanted to show you guys what I used because my lighting was kind of off. So I'm not sure it really picked up. Um, but I used this gold glitter from um, Wet n Wild. And it's not a loose glitter or anything. It's I think it's held by petroleum. I'm not even sure what it's called because I, when I ripped the packaging, I ripped the name off and everything. But the name of it is Brass, and it's a Wet n Wild something con. Yeah, it's not back here either. But it's um it's a glitter single. You can use it for the face or the body. And I bought it for 69 cents. I bought this a while ago, like towards the end of the summer, I believe I bought it. Or in the fall, I don't know. I don't know when I bought it. But when I bought it, it was on sale for 69 cents. And I kind of wanted to try because I've never tried glitter before. And I said, you know, for a first time, I think this would be pretty cool. When I put it on the lid, I didn't use any glitter glue because I felt like the petroleum would hold it together, which it did. Um, I've walked around for a couple of hours now with this on my face and I have no fallout from the glitter. But what I will say is that I think because of the the petroleum and how it stuck together it kind of did crease like fall into my crease a little bit um that is something that i did notice that i really didn't like but i kind of just want to try it out and see if i would like glitter on my lids and i i do i like how it came out um so i think when i purchase glitter in the future i'll actually do the glitter glue and i'll pick up the loose glitter and stuff like that but i think if um if you're just trying out glitter for the first time like I am, it looks or how, you know, how, learn how to apply it. I think this is pretty good for a first timer. Um, that's kind of all I wanted to say. And I want to wish you guys a very, very happy new year and that everything you want 2015 to be, it will be. And I will see you guys next year. Oh my God, I can't believe saying that. 2015. I began by priming my lid with the e.l.f. eyelid primer. And then I took my NYX eyeshadow base in the color uh, skin tone and I just put this all over the eyelid area. Going into my Maybelline Nudes palette, I just took that um, beige color as a, a brow bow highlight. And then going in with Makeup Geek's Coco Bear, I put this in my crease and this would be our transition color. Going into my Wet n Wild Vanity Palette, I took the dark brown and I put that directly into my crease. And then I took this gold shade and I put this um, all over my eyelid and this will kind of be another base for the glitter. And then I just blend it out um, with a tapered blending brush. There was no additional product on the blush, brush. And then I went in with the black and I'll place that um, along the outer corner of my eye. That's why I didn't put much gold there because I wanted to put the black shadow there. And I kind of just started off by placing the product. Um, I will deepen up the black later on. And for the glitter, I used the Wet n Wild color icon in the color Brass. And then I used a flat concealer brush to apply the, um, the glitter on my lid. And I really packed it on there like a lot. <laughs> After I was satisfied enough, I then I went in to use Makeup Geek's Corrupt. And this is how I just deepened up the black um, on the outer corner and a little bit into my crease, not going too far. I used Maybelline's Gel Liner and my Urban Decay um, Perversion Eyeliner. And then I also placed the eyeliner on my lower lash line because um, I'm going to smoke out the look. And taking my accent brush from Real Techniques, I then just use this to smudge out the black liner. I took Makeup Geek um, Cocoa Bear underneath, and then I used Chickadee, um, also Makeup Geek, to really fade out the black, which will give it the smoke. In my inner tear duct, I use this gold shade in the vanity palette 
For blush, I use MAC Raisin um, on my cheeks. And then as a highlighter, I use both Bobbi Brown, the limited edition, and the Shimmer Brick in bronze on top of each other. And it was popping, like for real. Mm -hmm. And I just used a large stippling brush to blend everything out. The first lip color, I used Revlon um, in the color Mink. And then on for gloss, I use the NYX, I believe it's in natural, on top. And this is with the first lip color. So for a second lip option, I went in with Night Moth and I used um, MAC Rebel as the lipstick. Originally I was gonna do a red, that's why I used the raisin. Um, but mid filming, I changed my mind and decided to use Rebel. So I would have probably used more of a berry blush. Um, but you know, I just kind of changed my mind because that's what I do. And this is the completed look, guys. I hope you like it. Um, it's very simple. It's affordable. I would say with the glitter, you might want to try something else because the longevity is not really there. But it's a cute look nonetheless. Enjoy, guys. And until next time.